Hello! Welcome to the tutorial! In this tutorial, I will teach you how to put capes on your VRCraft avatar. Before I start the tutorial, I highly recommend you to watch the video how to put your custom skin on VRCraft, because in that video I teach you how to configure the project in the right way. So it's really important that you watch that video. You can see it, the link on the screen and also on the description below. And also, if you want to learn how to put the VRCraft prefab on a custom avatar, you can also see the link on the screen and also on the description down below. Say that, let's start of the tutorial. First, navigate to the folder DX, VRCraft, and click here, VRCraft avatar. And you'll see this scene right here, when you can see the avatars and their capes in this case right here that we are gonna modify it but to modify it we need to found cape files and for that we need to enter in this site right here lamb.net slash capes you can also find this link on the description down below and here you can see it all the minecraft official capes and you can found one that you like it or the one that you have it for example i'm currently using the tiktok ones <laughs> it's cute don't judge me but i will put this on my avi so click here and you can see the freedom model yeah is this one that i want you can click in this button right here open a folder don't forget to put a name so tick talk cape <laughs> Perfect, and then we need to drop this in our projects. To do this, just found the folder you downloaded and drag and drop into your project. It's like that. Now that we import it, let's configure this image. So select the cape image and go to the inspector and search for compression and make sure to disable because this kills pixel art. And also, you need to find filter mode and change bilinear to point no filter and click apply. This makes sure for Unity that your cape is pixel perfect and it has no distortion. Perfect. And to apply this to your avatar, navigate the scene and double click it. And when the cape is surrounded by this orange outline, go to the inspector, scroll down expand this and you can see the official VRCraft cape. To replace that, just get your image and drop right here. And you can see it's already replaced the PC version, but we also need to replace the Quest version. So select the Quest, double click. So the orange outline means I selected the cape. Scroll down, expand the shader and drop the new cape into the VRCraft official cape. And it's done! Now everything you need to do is upload your avatar. If you wanna learn how to do this process, uploading your avatar both for PC and on Quest, I recommend you watching the video how to put your skin on VRCraft that is here on the screen and also on the description down below. And if you wanna learn how to put VRCraft on your custom avatar, you just need to click on this video on the screen and also on the description down below. And if you still don't have VRCraft, you can link on the screen or on the description below to have your own copy of VRCraft. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Bye-bye.